¡Hola! herself to express her undying gratitude to you for saving her ass. Stop talking. I was, I was only gone an hour. Checked her pulse? V She's gone. How'd this happen? I don't know. I told you. Evie was lying in bed like always. When I went out. And I got back to... Fuck. If I'd just known, I'd have... Don't blame yourself. It won't solve anything. I should have sensed something. That it was off. <laughs> Stop. Couldn't watch you 24-7. She made up her mind. Would have found a way. Always. Gotta do something with her. Don't want any trouble. I'm calling the badges. Can you carry her to the bed? As if that'll change anything. Not sure we should move her before the badges get here. She's just another dead whore to them. Nobody will care. The least we could do is treat her with some dignity. I need to report an accidental death. North side, Jackson Street. No. No imminent danger. <laughs> Suicide. Tomorrow. No! Today! What part of dead don't you understand? No, she was not pronounced dead by trauma team. If she'd have had coverage, we wouldn't be talking. And fuck you! If you don't want to move your asses, why don't I come down to the precinct and trash it into bits? Now will you come and arrest me, you pussies? Fine, I don't give a fuck what you write me up for. He'll be here soon. <laughs> Told me to keep her on ice until tomorrow. Can you believe the balls? All things considered, you let him off pretty light. Had it been me, they'd have gotten an earful like nobody's biz. Put something on her. I'd rather she look like a person than a body. Did you wait outside? Close the door, V. Please. I'm a cig. Didn't know you smoked. Uh, quit. It's been years. But right now I need something besides air in my lungs. Please, V, just one. Here. That 
was her smoke case. Want to hold on to it? No. You seem to like it. Keep it. Kind of glad it's you that has it, actually. I let her down. I thought if I gave her some t space or time, she'd get back on her feet. Stay strong, Judy. Don't let this tear you down. You know what? Let's just not say anything for a minute, okay? Her condition couldn't think about anything else. Tech-wise, she was clean. Doll Shard was operational, uncorrupted. So... Psychological trauma. Had to be that. Did some more digging in her virtues. Found Woodman. He kept her. Had his way with her. The things he did. And once he got bored, he pawned her off. Wait, so you found other recordings? Had another look at the corrupted ones. You know, lots of static. Hard to pick up anything, really. At some point, I stumbled on something like an echo of the spat we'd had last time we saw each other. But I know she wasn't scrolling. Then why was it saved as a virtue? Got no explanation for it. Maybe she recalled it later, relived it, almost implant could have been on when you know as a defense mechanism escaping into the past so as not to live in the present what did Woodman do to her did you see it yeah and I really wish I could unsee it I had no idea that guy was such a monster Saw him as your average tricksy sleazebag. It puts on a convincing facade. I knew him, but I never thought him that sick in the brain. Gotta be something I can do about it. Like what? Don't know yet. Think I'll call Sue's. Thanks, V. Sorry, but uh, I'd rather be alone now. Promise to keep in touch. Sure you don't need anything? No, but sweet of you to ask. Anything comes up, holler on the hollow. 